Good morning, everybody. I'm TJ Holmes. And I'm Brandy. Hit with the top stories today on this Tuesday, June 9th. And we begin with new developments in the search for two convicted killers who broke out of a maximum security prison in upstate New York. Richard Matt and David Sweat pulled off a sophisticated plan, including power tools, an extensive knowledge of that prison building, and an exit through a manhole. ABC News has also learned that a woman who works at the prison has been questioned by investigators. Joyce Mitchell has now been removed from her job. Protesters have gathered in McKinney, Texas, following that confrontation with police at a pool party. Demonstrators say black children were targeted when police arrived. Video of that incident now seen by more than a million people online uh, shows a police officer pushing a teenager to the ground, then pulling a gun on her friends. Demonstrators are demanding that that officer be fired for using profanity and for brandishing a gun. He is now on administrative leave. Former House Speaker Dennis Hastert appears in a Chicago courtroom later today for arraignment. Hastert was spotted for the first time in weeks there. Yesterday, as he drove back to Illinois from his vacation home in Wisconsin, he is expected to plead not guilty to lying to the FBI about withdrawing money from his bank. That cash allegedly used for hush money over sex abuse claims. And tonight, Game 3 of the NBA Finals, Golden State Warriors, mm-hmm. Cleveland Cavaliers, series tied up at a game each, and in Cleveland, they are going through some extreme measures. They need all the support they can get. (laughs) Newborn to the Cleveland Clinic, getting into the act. You see them there, they got onesies. They read all in, along with the Cavs logo. The phrase all in is the marketing motto for the playoffs. When a newborn is wearing it, there's something a little extra special about it. Yeah, no matter who you root for, I think that's just too cute. No matter who you root for, who you rooting for. I don't know, maybe Golden State. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe, just a little bit. She's our golden girl here from L.A. Yeah. We love our brandy kids. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm TJ Holmes. And you're rooting for Cleveland, right? I'm Brandy Hit for the Dub Nation. Go Warriors. Have a good day.